Pancreatic ductal adenocarcinoma is difficult to treat because it is resistant to most forms of therapy. One potential vulnerability is the expression of a mutated form of the KRAS oncogene. Researchers recently examined whether adoptive cellular therapy, with T cells engineered to express a T cell receptor targeting a common hotspot mutation in pancreatic cancer, could elicit tumor regression in a single patient. The patient was a 71 year old woman who had progressive metastatic pancreatic adenocarcinoma, refractory to previous therapies. She received a single infusion of autologous T cells, genetically engineered to clonally express two HLA restricted allogeneic T cell receptors that targeted mutant KRAS G12D expressed by the tumors. Several days before infusion, she received prophylactic therapy to prevent cytokine release syndrome and cyclophosphamide preconditioning therapy. Beginning 18 hours after infusion, she received high-dose interleukin-2 to support the expansion of the infused T-cells. One month after T-cell infusion, computed tomography showed regression of the patient's metastatic lung lesions. At six months, tumor regression was ongoing with an overall objective partial response of 72%. Engineered T-cells constituted 2.4% of all circulating T-cells six months after infusion. The authors conclude that adoptive cellular therapy with T-cells expressing a T-cell receptor gene targeting the KRAS G12D hotspot mutation prompted the regression of metastatic pancreatic cancer. Full study results are available at nejm.org.